this week we have the launch of our honey, um, which will be for sale at the BT branch. So we're very excited about that. That's been a long time coming. Um, it's a partnership that we built off the ground before the pandemic. Um, but of course, the pandemic stalled our ability to be able to um, install the beehives and then obviously sell the honey. But now we're finally selling the honey, which is very exciting. Um, so like I said, that will be available from the Beatty branch, but we'll also be selling parts of the honey at the farmer's market this weekend, where we'll also be promoting all of the things that are happening this week in celebration of the bee. Our new logo actually is a multi-award winning logo. We've won two awards internationally from the American Library Association and the Urban Libraries Council in Washington. Um, because they acknowledge the innovation in the, uh, in the logo and the rebranding in terms of responding to a more um, progressive and a more diverse community. We took the tagline that already existed, Be Inspired. We knew that we wanted to celebrate the Beatty branch more than we had done historically. So we, we had lots to play with on the B theme. So we, we took the Be Inspired, we came up with Beatty, we thought about bees, we thought about libraries as hives of activity, as um, a, col um, a, a collaborative space, as a, as a space where the whole community is able to connect a lot like bees, right? For whatever reason. Um, so so we've got lots of programming, we've got um, a Q&A with the um, Beehive owner, I guess, the owners of the Beehive company, Humble Bee Inc, Luke. Um, he's going to be answering all of your questions related to bees. We've also got a Q&A and a session with Third Moon Brewing, because uh, we also have a partnership with them where we've donated some of the honey in order to have um, a brew made out of the beet branch honey and uh, we'll be making a contribution to the MCRC so all of the profits from that will actually be going to them. Uh, we've got story walks in partnership with Conservation Halton um, celebrating the bee and all of the pollinating um, plants that are available to the bees around Halton region and there's a whole host of other activities going on so I would encourage anyone that's interested to find out more to check out our website beeinspired.ca and all of the details around Bee Week will be on there.